COVID-19 is still circulating in our communities. Practicing behaviours that will protect us from COVID-19 is important and now part of our daily life. This means wearing face masks in crowded spaces where physical distancing is difficult. Also, keep your hands clean and cover your coughs and sneezes with a tissue or the inside of your elbow. Getting a vaccination is the best way to protect yourself against the severe effects of COVID-19. The vaccines will help to protect you and your family from getting really sick. Evidence shows people who are vaccinated are less likely to become seriously ill or die from COVID-19. Looking after the health of our community is everyone's responsibility. It is important that you get tested for COVID-19 if you have symptoms like fever, a cough, a sore throat, or are experiencing shortness of breath. Though self-isolation is no longer compulsory if you test positive, experts strongly encourage you to stay at home. Staying at home when sick reduces the risk of spreading the virus, especially to the elderly and others at risk of becoming seriously ill. If you need to leave the house, please practice the behaviours that will help protect your community and slow the spread of COVID-19. Remember to wash your hands often, wear a mask and avoid crowded spaces where people might be at more risk of becoming very sick if infected with COVID-19. This is especially important in aged and disability care facilities, hospitals and health settings. If you are at high risk of severe illness and you do test positive for COVID-19, you might be eligible for oral treatments. Oral treatments can help reduce the risk of severe illness and death from COVID-19. Ask your doctor if you are eligible for these treatments. The treatment works best when taken within the first five days of your diagnosis. So talk to your doctor as soon as possible. Call the National Coronavirus Helpline anytime for information and advice about COVID-19. 1800 020 080. This service is available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. For free interpreting services, press option eight. For more information, you can visit health.gov.au or healthdirect.gov.au.